As a wine family, we spend all our time pairing wine and food. And I've chosen this lamb recipe because it's, it's easy. You can feed lots of people and it goes very well with this particular wine, which is the official wine of Mother's Day, which is a Cabernet. And I think for Mother's Day, it's an, an obvious wine because you don't have to know a lot about wine to enjoy a wine like this. And everyone knows that South African lamb is so delicious, so that's why I've chosen a lamb dish. The most important thing about Mother's Day for me is A, that we're all together, and B, that everyone's cooking and taking part. And that is how the little ones get an idea of how this whole system works and that it's easy to cook and it's easy to make delicious food and they learn from the next ones. Eventually, they'll be cooking and I'll be watching. Oh, my mother was so nice. We always wanted to be like her, but I don't think any of us were as nice as she was. She, um, she always thought about other people before herself. Although I think I see that in my daughter. Maybe it skipped a generation. Oh, the First Lady is named after me, very sweetly by my children, because they call me the First Lady in Wine because I was definitely one of the First Lady winemakers in the Cape. So they decided to bring out this range in my honor, which is, I think, very, very sweet of them. Tomato paste. Well, I think one of the most gratifying things in South Africa is that we can actually just go down to pick and pay and get everything we need. It's not pre-packaged. You can select fresh vegetables and buy your lamb, butcher, one stop, get everything. Another official wine of Mother's Day is the First Lady Anouk Chardonnay. I think you want to serve it with a fish, either a, a grilled fish, but a poached fish is, is the nicest thing that I think goes with this because it's quite delicate. And then naturally, you use some of it when you're poaching the fish. That is totally delicious. One of the most important things about this recipe and all wine recipes is that you use a good wine. Use a wine that we, you would drink. Don't use some leftover wine that you didn't like that's oxidized and horrible. It'll ruin the dish. Use a good wine, and this is a good one. So I'm gonna pop this into the oven, and we are going to leave it for about two hours to cook. Right, the lamb's done. Let's get it out of the oven. Half an hour ago, I put the onions and the mushrooms in and thickened this with a bit of flour. It looks absolutely perfect. Mother's Day really is a day to honor your mother, but it's about friends and family and being together. So if you want to put this lovely thing together, go down and get the official wine of Mother's Day from Pick and Pay and really enjoy it with this dish. And perhaps you should leave a little bit more in the bottle than I did when I was cooking. Have a happy Mother's Day.